Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. This is Peter Drury, and next to me providing insights will be Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. I'm ready to see what unfolds in this one now. And so the distinctive sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem. Carvajal. Tries a through ball. It's a loose ball. We sit high. Shade too heavy. Keeper can pick that up. Azar. Benzema. Modric. Benzema pings it out wide. Benzema showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Drives it towards the front. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And it's Benzema. Isco. Now the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. it through tries to stroke it through Sergio Ramos does well there alert Casemiro tries to root one option No efforts on target is acceptable if levels of enthusiasm and energy are good, and they're not. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Whipped in. Yeah, he's offering an apology for that, he needed to deliver a better ball. That's art. That was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. It's a forceful run down the right, but he's short of options now. And it's Benzema. Looks to slip it through. Can he finish? Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. Yeah, and that was all about the through ball. Great control, and the weight was perfect. it upfield Daniel Carvajal gets into the right position to intercept Isco now the pass Carvajal tries the volley saved only by poor finishing like a good ball through well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there the idea was good though Peter and I like the run that triggered the pass but the quality was the problem well, that looks a foul yep referee's given it a 
and it's Isco. Daniel Carvajal. If anyone is going to break the deadlock, now would be a good time. Rafael Varane. Daniel Carvajal. Looks to slip it through. Puts it into the middle. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. Massive leap! He will be livid with himself. Forward it goes. Azar demanding a quick ball here. And the referee brings the first half to a close. The midway point of the game. Real Madrid ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil-nil. Real Madrid clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the... In the st and he's done it! And some players are just capable of grabbing a game by the scruff of the neck. And his immense talent may just have done exactly that and injected the belief that they can retain their lead this time round. He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. Benzema. Done very well to intervene. Real Madrid have a free kick. And he's going to have his name taken. Aim forward. Goes wide. Fires it in low. He's dealt with that well. Tony Kroos, this is promising, it's Benzema! Oh, great save, real class. Oh, he made that look really easy, Peter, but I can assure you that wasn't a, a routine save, he had to be very switched on there. Oh, he really wanted that. He's been a joy to watch, and, and that didn't miss by much, he'll be back. a matter of inches well I think the keeper knows all too well that there was no getting anywhere near that that's a big escape so Jim what are you thinking Peter they're leaving nobody guessing now this is a decisive attempt to go further in front Hazard, Tony Kroos, plays it out to the wing. Isco. Passes it through. This is quite a run and he's not done yet. He slid it through. Shapes the shoots. He's done very well to get to that. 
Well, I can only add that he's got reflexes that are in perfect working order, Peter. That was very good to watch. Ginter tosses it to the box. Ah, that was just asking too much of his teammates by playing it in so early. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Isco is fouled. He gets a ticking off and needs to be very careful now. He just needs to find the control button on his aggression before the ref does it for him, Peter. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, and having notched a goal already, Peter, he's not going to be allowed to run off the shoulder as, as much as he'll want. Well, he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. Real Madrid with a chance here to increase their lead. It's anyone's ball! And it's Carvajal. There's a real confidence about them, and they look as though fitness levels and energy are still strong, but they have to maintain possession. They can't afford to lose it again. Played out to the wing. Deflected behind for a corner kick. And out to safety. Tries a through ball. Rafael Varan cuts it out. Daniel Carvajal. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Tries lifting it over. Now the pass. Now it's Hazard. Steered out wide. Boots it to safety. So that's it. It is all over. Real Madrid win it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. Yeah, and I think after that sultry second-half goal, they did what all good teams do and protected their lead. Well, that's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.